While filming one of their movies, Gregory Peck and Ingrid Bergman reportedly had an affair even though he never revealed the extent of their relationship. He was known to be the embodiment of the gentleman in his days. The public paid tribute to his natural confidence, and soon the handsome actor with a deep voice and pleasant face found himself among the most prominent male stars. Being a masculine and handsome man, as well as a guarantor of values and morals in his films. He caught Hitchcock's attention and was Ingrid Bergman's troubled patient in the movie Spellbound in 1945. By the 1950s, he had become a true star. On the set of Spellbound, Gregory Peck fell head over heels for Ingrid. He didn't tell anybody about the affair until five years after she'd passed. In an interview, he confessed, All I can say is that I had a real love for Bergman, and I think that's where I ought to stop. I was young. She was young. We were involved for weeks in close and intense work. Thriving in the popular westerns, military films, and adventure films of the time, Peck was known to bring a lot of authenticity to his roles, thus lending a certain quality to any films he starred in. In 1942, just as Gregory's career kicked off, the actor married a Finnish beauty. Greta Kakonen, and they had three sons together. Unfortunately, one of his sons committed suicide. Thirteen years later, the couple had an amicable divorce. However, they stayed friends till the last days. It was during the first marriage that he was allegedly accused of having an affair with Bergman. To know that he was still married at the time, it happened during his first marriage and that Ingrid Bergman was also married. It was an extramarital affair with both cheating a real scandal. Bergman encouraged Peck privately and cheered him up because Bergman was a graduate from the Royal Swedish Academy of Drama, and he could also give him useful advice in terms of acting skills. As a result, the handsome men and beautiful women in their prime have more and more contacts, and they have more developed feelings on the set. What is even more surprising is that in the third month of the filming, Peck, who was unable to restrain himself, proposed to Bergman that the two should elope. Bergman was shocked. At that time, the two had their own marriage. If such a thing happened, the careers of the two would be ruined. Bergman calmly persuaded him to finish the film first before making a decision. After the shoot, the two ended their relationship in later interviews. Bergman was asked about her impression of Peck. She said that Peck was very melancholy, neurotic, and bold in private. That's why she broke up with him. Click here to watch this video next.